Hey, what is going on, guys? It's the Game Your Pro Resonance TGP, and in today, we're going to be talking about the secret camo in Call of Duty 4 Remastered. Because as you guys know, YouTubers were sent out a couple days ago to go ahead and capture multiplayer gameplay of COD 4. And what they did showcase was the firing range coming back, which was from Advanced Warfare, which is a good thing. And everybody liked that a lot because you get to see the camos, you get to see the weapons, especially the supply drops one that were in there. And on top of that, the most important thing, as I said, was the camos. So the YouTubers were filming the camos, which, which look absolutely sick. There are the these old ones that you guys know from COD 4 and there are some new ones like this dragon type camo that is that really replicates the one from Black Ops 2 that was a DLC one. I don't re quite remember what the uh, name of that was in Black Ops 2 but if you guys do know what it is please be sure to put it in the comment section down below. So what I wanted to talk about today is the secret camo that is called Regal. I believe it's in the diamond tier section it's going to look something along the lines of diamonds. So if that is you know the big camo you guys know how there was gold diamond and then dark matter and black Black Ops 3. Who knows? Maybe they're going to add something above Rego Camo. It's going to be a secret camo that you only unlock after getting this Rego slash Diamond Camo on each and every single class of your, you know, choice. Like Assault Rifle, Submachine Gun, LMG, Sniper Rifle. You get everything Rego. Do you get this new Dark Matter, I guess you can call it, this new secret uh, camo that's going to be in uh, Call of Duty 4 Remastered because as you know with the uh, gameplay that they showed us gold and diamond Orego was actually locked you weren't able to see a preview but all of the other camos you were so I'm guessing they want to keep this a secret they want to see who can unlock it faster and I believe that I'm going to really sit on this Rego camo and try to get as fast as possible because I know that I am an insane person when it comes to getting diamond and maybe even a camo you know above that when it comes to trying to get it first or trying to see how it looks like I am really dedicated to try to do this especially when I love a game so much and COD 4 was an awesome game and honestly if you guys want the true opinion with me I think that it's great that they're adding something new to the game even though they're calling it a remaster I love how they added the inspect this new Rego camo and maybe they're going to add some more things. I really hope they don't add supply drops and, you know, if Raven Software doesn't really have, you know, the power to say no to Activision or their game is not going to be published. So, you know, hopefully there's not going to be any supply drops, but, you know, anything can happen these days, you know. So, if you guys want the complete end story and if you guys want to see the whole entire uh, you know, breakdown of Regal, I guess you can call it, or the Diamond Camo. Go check out other YouTubers' gameplay because they actually show you all of the camos, the old ones that were in COD 4 Remastered, and as well as the new ones that were in, um, that were introduced into Call of Duty 4 Remastered. And I think they are actually pretty sick. I don't know if they're gonna add any more, if they're just gonna do DLC, or they're gonna be in supply drops or something, but if they're going to stick supply drops to camos only in COD 4 Remastered and leave all the weapons to Infinite Warfare, that is going to be the great de the decision that they're gonna do because I am super excited to unlock camos. I think that is sick if it's like, you know, camos, calling cards, emblems, I don't really care about that if because, you know, people are not gonna spend money on that and you, maybe like, you know, lower the price, I, I don't know what they're gonna do, but hopefully the best route to go is to not have any supply drops and then unlock camos via headshots, long shots, uh, one shot kills, anything really that is in a Call of Duty game. You guys know, you know, boots on the ground, that's what everybody loves and Infinite Warfare didn't have the greatest reputation at start and people still don't like the beta. So I'm actually really confused about what to upload, but I think I'm gonna stick to COD 4 Remaster, trying to get that Rego camo, trying to get the Diamond camo or whatever it's called because I really, really am curious to see what it looks like because I actually searched it up on Google and it really doesn't show me a lot. It's just a bunch of these, these different colors and it's like a rainbow pattern. I don't know. It's kind of weird. You guys can search it up, but it, it doesn't uh, It doesn't seem that it's going to be anything near diamond, but that's what I'm guessing it's going to be, and maybe even something above that is going to be um, announced soon. Maybe there's going to be a, a camo above regular. That's going to be in, you know, an interview with Infinity Ward or Raven Software. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. If you're new, thank you all so much for watching, and as always, guys, I will see you in the next one. Peace out.